right, Trash Panda Nation. How you doing? Tricky Ricky here, promotions manager and on-field MC with my BFF Sprocket. You, you know this guy right here, but with my best human friend as well, Destin Sandlin. You know him for smarter every day. And you can see we got a little something planned here. I'm not very smart. My nickname in school was dumber every day. So it's nice to be with someone on the other side. Can you, what we got going on here, Des? Yeah, this, as you can see, the supersonic baseball cannon right here. So we pressurize this thing with gas and then we put whatever you want in there. I think baseball is what we're thinking about shooting because yeah. it's a baseball cannon part. We're gonna fire baseball and that's, that's really all there is to it, yeah. Look at it. We got a big old cannon behind me and uh, I think I'd like to do something with it. Can you help us out? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I don't have anything to shoot. I don't have baseballs, I don't have targets, but I know how to operate it. You tell me what to do and I'm game. Let's go. All right, I think, I think we have something ready for that. All right, Sprocket and myself standing here next to our target, three baseball bats. And this isn't just any three baseball bats that we picked out. These bats right here are cursed. Okay, do you see these? Do you see the bats? They produced zero hits for the Trash Pandas this past season. They produced way more than zero strikeouts for the Trash Pandas this season. It's been in the building. I can feel the bad luck coming from the clubhouse up into the office. It's time to get rid of these bats, and in what better way than to shoot a baseball at it at supersonic speeds? Sprocket, let's get to safety. Okay, so Ricky, what am I doing? Uh, it looks like you're carrying a large metal plate with some uh, baseball bats duct tied to it with your only help being a six foot raccoon in a baseball uniform. Okay. Man versus creature. Or in this case, just working together to move a metal plate with baseball bats duct taped to it so we can shoot things at a very, very high speed. What are we doing, Ricky? All right, guys, uh, I can see the bats. I think we need to go three nautical clips to the port side. Okay, got it. Yeah, what, I don't know what that means. What? No? Okay, okay, sorry. I, uh, going back to my old Navy days. Let's just bring it, like, over there a little bit. Okay, yeah. Oh, come on. Where is this thing? All right, go back to where it was a little bit. You can keep uh, just, just a little bit more. To the right? Yeah. All right, now I'm in the middle of the bat, so, of that, la of that far right bat. Yeah, that's good. Okay. That'll work. The idea of shooting cursed bats is something that never occurred to me. I oh, love yeah. it. They're evil. Yeah, they are. You gotta get rid of them. <laughs> you gotta get rid of those things. Sprocket. You want to get back here and hold this back side of the pole up? Pull, turn around, hold that. Two hands. Yeah, bring it on back. All right. Okay. Yeah, ram it on home. <laughs> you got it. Now pull the ramrod out, Sprocket. We don't want to do that. Perfect. All right, we'll set this over to the side. There's a control box over there. Don't touch anything, okay? Don't touch the control box. Put your hands up, man. Yeah. Verify cameras connected and on, done. Pickle switch in hand, not a thing. Everybody in a safe location. All right, here's the deal. You ready? Okay, so we ready to actually shoot this thing? I think. Okay, so like you got the box, man. You gotta be focused on that. All right, I'm focused on it. Until the desired pressure. So hit this button. How much pressure you got on there? Down. There we go. Yeah, okay. 209? Yeah, right, so basically you're, you'll come hand back over up right here. Yeah. You got that? Okay. Back, over, up, shoot. Back, over, up, shoot. We got this. The cursed bats are still out there somehow alive. These bats really, I mean, 
I don't know what happened to them, but they're they're something evil in these things, and we got it. I like how he said it was just a fake curse. <laughs> yeah, someone's told me. Hey, uh. I didn't. We got it. We got it. I think we got. And go. Whoa. Uh. Um. The, oh, the bats are yeah. That I. Ooh. I was looking right in their into their eyes. Maybe we, no, you want to you want to see what we did? We should probably at least do that. I uh, we're right here. Yeah. Woo. Okay, here we go. Got to check out the wreckage. Here we are, Sprocket. We're here at the site of all the wreckage. Bats were here, and now bats are here. As you see, we got some right here. This guy, right? What is, what is up with this bat? It's, I don't know. We, the rest of them are gone, and this one right here, you don't want to know what we're going to do with that thing, all right? But we've done what we came to accomplish today. Sprocket's grabbing wreckage. Go ahead and bring that thing over here, Sprocket. Show the people what we got. Yeah, these cursed bats are no more. Sprocket, I don't know if you did that quite perfectly, but you did do it. It's a good job. Everybody, we're out of here. You sauce blow up some stuff. We should probably get to safety now.